Chad. Chad. Chad, honey, listen to me. Chad. I think I do really. Chad, oh my God, you're so cold. <laughs> Sweetheart. Okay, honey, Chad. Chad. Listen to me, Chad. Chad, don't you do this to me. Don't do this, okay? Oh, God. Come back, Chad, please, please. Please, 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 please. Oh, my God. Oh, thank you. Have a kill, what are you doing? Gabby, I got Gabby. Her pulse was really weak. He wasn't even breathing at all. All right, we gotta get him out of here. Call 911. Come on, come on, sweetheart. Come on, come on. What is taking so long? Doctor said he'd come talk to us as soon as he knew something. They're gonna be okay. You don't know that? The EMT said that we got there just in time. And after all the time that I wasted away from him and Thomas, I mean, if he doesn't... No, 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 you can't. You can't think like that. You are going to get through this. Okay. Hey. Hi, how are they? Are they going to be okay? Their core temperatures are nearly back to normal. I expect them to make a full recovery. Oh, thank God. Um, can we go in and see them, please? They're both still unconscious, but go ahead. They're lucky you found them when you did. Thank you. What are you doing? You heard them, they're gonna be okay. Yeah, it's nothing. <clears throat> Thinking about how you found them. Under the tarp, almost naked. I'm being silly. I mean, everybody knows that when you're freezing, the best way to stay warm is to share body heat, so probably save their lives, right? Probably. Do you think I'm being naive? I think you should go in there and see your husband. 